What's up, gang? This is Ken Zerk, Ken Zilligan, Zika Milligan, and Venom Filling Trilligan. And we are back on Persona 3 Reload. Yeah, last episode, I don't I don't think a lot of stuff happened last episode. But I know stuff did happen last episode. Oh yeah, we got a transfer student. I don't like him. He looks like uh, uh he looks like a creepy. Morning. I heard Kirijo Senpai is coming back today. How is she? I don't know. What should I even say to her? I wouldn't be surprised if she's not up for talking, though. Oh lord. Yeah, her daddy dead. She ain't. She ain't. She ain't gonna be fine for a bit. Her daddy dead. Her daddy dead. Negatory. Ryoji is dangerous. I have reanalyzed him and still detect nothing out of the ordinary. Nonetheless, I have a bad feeling about him. Where is this Ryoji bum anyways? I'm not hanging out with you, bro. Uh, I guess I'll hang with him. Oh, Kenzillion. I was about to hit the club. What are you going to do today? But we can go closer thanks to the Fortune Persona. Like, I feel like I might grow closer to Hiragi soon. Great, then let's go. For now, draw whatever you want. Just let me know if you have any questions. I'm finna draw naked women. The scratching of pencils echoes throughout the art room. It's been fun. It's been so fun that hours flew by. Let's wrap up for today. Good work, everyone. <sighs> All done. I didn't get to draw right. the last hit. Let's clean up and go home. <sighs> oh, snap. What's wrong? What's wrong? What happened to you? a lot lately mm, it's just a little headache I don't think it's anything to worry about I right, they keep it pushing you should really figure out what's causing the pain it might lead to serious complications down the road does anywhere else hurt are your nose and throat all right he a little wor he, he he worried like about her advice Hirag is getting the details of Fuka's symptoms is he a doctor? Oh boy, here we go. Keisuke Senpai strikes again. He looks insane. Why is he staring like that? Yamagishi san won't be going anywhere for a while. Strikes again. If someone isn't feeling well, he always tries to figure out what's wrong. And it doesn't matter when or where. Once he starts, it takes forever. Bro, how much is Ryan? Keisuke Senpai's dad's the director of a big hospital, and he's an only child. I guess he just can't stand to see people suffer. I bet he'll end up going to medical school. So the pain's originating from the back of your head? Could you turn around, please? Oh, Lord. Ah, don't worry. It's just a chronic tension-type headache. Most likely the result of stress. You might be spending too much time in front of the computer. Try to get outside and exercise more. That's a crazy. Oh, never mind. Cause she, nah. Cause she not active like us. She she be. It must seem funny to get medical advice from the head of the art club. I was worried I'd come down with the flu or something. In that case, I can do a more thorough check. Could you remove your shirt? Oh 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 oh. And stick out your tongue. No. Okay. That's a little too much. What? Okay, I'm fine. Besides, our dorm isn't far, so he can accompany me back. Uh, sorry, sorry. Wait, you two live in the dorms? I guess I see it in Yamagishi-san. She seems like the well-adjusted type. I bet you're a great cook. <laughs> okay, yeah. Do you take care of the laundry? Is living alone hard? Ooh, don't take an interest. Oh my lord. What's up with this guy? What's up with this guy? Oh, sorry, Yamagishi-san. I forgot about your condition. I know it's close, but I don't think you should be walking home. Why don't I call you a taxi? Though a bumpy taxi ride might make your headache worse. Maybe a limousine would be better. What? Uh, Bro. Okay, I'm fine. Let the poor girl go, all right? Let it go. You're being extra. 
Talking about a limousine. Kira Joe. Welcome back. Mitsu has just returned to the dorm. She looked really tired. She went straight to her room without saying a word. Are you worried? I speculate. Worried? No, not exactly. How should I say this? I feel... I feel responsible for what happened. Good. Let's see what can uh, Let's see what Amato wants. What's up? Senpai. I know you must be busy, but do you have time to come with me tonight? Uh, what? Thank you very much. Thanks. I wasn't sure I'd be able to go there alone. Court Island Station. So then, I took it apart and put it somewhere. <laughs> I want to go to a bar called K Sera Sera. It's down this way. I was thinking of getting Mitsuru-san a gift, and uh, I heard I might be able to buy what I'm looking for at the bar. Hey, what's up with them? Who knows? You got an issue? What's a kid doing here? Mm, maybe it's too dangerous, but supposedly it's only open at night. Let's check it out. Oh, okay. I don't like I want freaking Mazio anybody that step up. Now there's little kids running around. Oh, it's become so wholesome here. Hey, it's past your bedtime, little boy. I'm about to jerk you off. Keep playing with me, bro. Back up. Mommy's waiting for you. <laughs> bro, let's just keep it pushing. Why are we sitting here? Why are we sitting here waiting for them, bro? Let's keep it pushing. Thank you, but I'm all right. If I let it bother me, then it'll never go away. I just want to finish what I came here for. This looks like the place. The owner here is really particular about the taste of his drinks. They say he has ingredients you can't normally find. And for one of the cocktails he makes, he uses an extremely rare tea leaf. Mmm, that's what you're looking for. Yes, I've seen Mitsuru-san drinking tea in the lounge. So when I was thinking of a gift that would make her happy, this is what came to mind. I hope the bar owner is willing to share some of it, though. Well, he looked scary, but... At least he agreed to sell it to us in the end. <laughs> Boy, I'm glad that worked out. I can't wait to give this to Mitsuru-san. That's sweet. With everything that happened, I'm sure she's been having a hard time. It's sad and painful to be in a home knowing that you'll never see a loved one there with you again. So, I'm hoping this makes things more pleasant for her. At least while she's at the dorm. She really lost two people close to her. She lost, uh, she lost an old friend, Aragaki, and she lost her pops. That's Although, horrible. Although, it is Mitsuru-san we're talking about, so I'm sure she'll be fine. I just thought it would be nice if she was able to think about things over a delicious cup of tea. I'm sure she'll like it. Thanks. I feel a lot better hearing you say that. I thought about it a lot, and this is the best I could come up with. Well, we should head back before it gets too late. What's wrong? Nah, it's nothing. Yeah, this is where you got Aragaki killed. Thanks for joining me today, Senpai. And sorry for making you worry about all that stuff. We haven't really talked properly since what happened to Aragaki-san. I keep thinking about the last thing he said to me. I have to live for myself. But how exactly do I do that? Duh, you are a child. Worry about that later. I wasn't sure where to start. But I've been trying all kinds of things. Things that the old me would have never considered. Like... Hanging out with my friends at school, reading manga, and even watching TV. I'm also trying to make an effort to talk to people in the dorm more. Mitsuru-san helped me with my homework the other day. And I even beat Junpei-san in a video game. <laughs> oh, 
I also ate snacks with Yukari-san and the others, and I guess son helped me feed hamburger. Who's ham? Oh, the, the rabbit. The, no, the hamster. I realized that little things like this can really make life enjoyable. Well, that's what I've learned so far. Keep it up, little man. Don't invite me next time, but keep it I up. Will. I've done enough thinking. Now, I just want to try doing all kinds of new things. I think I have an idea of how to live my life again. You know, I've noticed other people in the dorm talk about you a lot. I'm gonna go. Everyone seems to be really happy when they do, too. The hard battles continue, but we're still able to keep going. And it's because we all know when we come back, they'll always be there for us. That's an exaggeration. Come on. I, I, I know I'm the you GOAT, so? but I'm not that much of well, the GOAT. That's how I feel, at least. You're always leading the way and giving everyone courage. Come on, you fly, you flatter me. I want to be more like you, senpai. Come on, you're flattering me. You're flattering me. I want to continue learning from your example. That's okay, right? I don't know if Anyways, I'm the best sorry example. It took so long. The night air is getting chilly. Shall we go back home? I don't know if I'm the best example. I have uh, said quite a nasty, quite a few nasty things. I did quite a few nasty things. Hey there. Have we talked to that new transfer student yet? Isn't he handsome? Oh, totally. Mochizuki, yeah. He's sweet and dreamy. Also, he looks rich. I'm going for him for real this time. What? That's not fair. I call dibs. Oh my, dear. There's a mistake there. That's not how you write, GeckoCon. I know, I know. I hardly ever write it, so... I just forgot how it looked for a second. I feel a little bad for all the people who've been campaigning to save the tree. Oh! <laughs> Speak of the devil! Uh, I'm writing a letter. Something I haven't done in ages. I'm used to the keyboard doing all the work for me. What? Is that surprising? I'm actually quite the net surfer, you know. Are you? Uh, what does the letter say? No, oh, no, no, don't look. Oh, I'm shy. <laughs> we'll tell you when the time is right. Are you curious about the letter? Excited, perhaps? Even exhilarated? Exhilarated. We are, too. We spend every day looking forward to the chance of seeing you again. Sometimes you even make me feel smarter. Maybe I should just go back to school. Ah, just kidding. They really rock with me, bro. Like, oh, I'm, I'm not expecting to really be rocked with this heavy. Am I? Why? I said, uh, I hope we can wrap up the matter before your next visit. Why do y'all like me this much? I don't, I don't, I don't get it. I don't get it. Why do y'all like me this much? <laughs> Tartars. I guess Mitsuru can't go to Tartarus yet. You fit a two man to the top of the dungeon. I just want some extra levels. I don't care about them. I can, I can clock them up one day. Come on, kill it, kill it, kill it. Thank you. Days may break me, but I'll always get back up. But he hit my weakness and everything, and it just didn't do anything. Be a good 
good test of your strength. But don't get careless. I have to do this. Not too long ago, I don't think we would have stood a chance against an enemy that tough. Or do you think we've gotten even stronger? Of course. <laughs> First started out, I took everything I had just to summon my persona. Let's keep it moving. Ooh, that was a fight right there. That was a fight, but I did that. Exploring. What's up? 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 That's what I thought. I'm about to say you can't you can't use the shadows to block the hit for you. Take it down if you can. You can't turn that one down. You can't turn that one down. Alright, take him out. Bro came in like he was important! Just, he came in like he was important just to get foddered, bro. Powerful enemy spotted! Please be careful! My goodness, why did they just start? Why did they randomly level up? Doesn't that one look pretty tough? 
you don't really mean too much of anything to me, so Treasure? I'm not really worried about y'all. We should be getting close. Oh, I'm sure a border floor is five floors up from here. All of that's just a miss, little bro. Oh. I have to do this. We did it. All enemies defeated. Good work out there. We did it. Yeah. Lily Petal, you can now fuse Lilith, the queen of the night. We won. Feels like I'm on top of my game today. Maybe it's because my horoscope said that Libras are supposed to... Okay, whatever. I'll read your palm too. Hold on. Huh? Never took you as a time to be interested in. Hey, is any kind of pool you try to hold my hand? Who am I kidding? You know Junpei. Well, they say luck is a skill, right? So it wouldn't hurt to believe in good omens. Wait, has the date changed already? Do horoscopes change during the dark hour? Ah, uh, my curiosity is killing me. Hey, doesn't that chest... Curiosity brutally slaughtered the cat. I just got here myself. Are you going to be at the art club today? Looking forward to seeing you there. I let the club advise to know about you. Is she bad? Everyone, attention please. I have an announcement regarding the recent Bay Area Art Contest. Hiraga Kun's painting was selected for consideration in the final round. Huh? 
Your piece was really good. You might even win. Please, it's all thanks to my paintbrush. I was lucky to use my dad's quality raccoon hair one. It really helped apply the paint to the canvas. So I'm sure that's the only reason the judges even noticed. Bro, you got talent, bro. Thank you. But I've only been painting for about two years now. So I never imagined my piece would go so far. You should have more confidence in yourself. You've been practicing so hard. He's right. Everyone knows how late you stay. Thanks, guys. But I should be supporting all of you, not the other way around. I'm sorry. I should be setting a better example for new members like you. I may not be much of an artist or a leader, but I hope we can keep working to improve our skills together. Uh, sure. B better, yeah. What is bro's issue? No confidence in yourself? I've come this far. Might as well continue this for as long as I can. Oh, look at the time. Time to head home, everyone. How do I convince him? Why am I... I feel kind of weak. Your breathing is impaired and your lips are pale. Did you get enough sleep last night? And what do you usually have for lunch? Uh, now that I think about it, I, I didn't eat breakfast today. Mm-hmm. I see. Just as I thought. Looks like anemia. Probably from an unbalanced diet. It must be all the fast food. I recommend adding more shellfish to your diet, like oyster and abalone. Yo, They're packed with iron and easy. Yo, you can give him advice later. How about we get him to safety first? Uh, will he be okay? Well, this is just my amateur diagnosis, but you should still see a professional. I'm not a real doctor, after all. Stop talking his head off and I'll get him to safety. The office. You guys should head on home. Thank you. You again. I thought your face looked familiar. You here again, kid? <laughs> Even Buddha's not that forgiving. All right, that's it. I'm gonna hand you over to the bouncer and... Well, there's no Buddha in this world, so... Stop looking at me like that and sit down, kid. You're a Buddhist monk that doesn't believe in... What? So tell me. That fun hanging out with an old monk whose own wife and kid left him? Are you venting at me? How come you're always alone when I see you? Don't you got any friends? Can't say I don't. What the hell's that supposed to mean? Either you do or you don't. Go get smart with me, kid. What would you call a friend anyway? And where do you draw the line between friend and acquaintance let's define a friend as someone you hold dear the way i see it no one in this world ever really cares for others people always want something out of a relationship they only really love themselves uh you seem to be talking from experience mister is that what your wife did to you, you don't call someone who doesn't like you your friend do you no because you know you won't get nothing from them which means in this world, there's no one you can truly hold dear. At the end of the lonely road of love, kid, you're the only one left standing there. What? You see those gals over there? The ones on the dance floor? You can bring one of them over here. I'll be your friend in return, huh? What do you think? I know you can do it. He has a warped trust in me. Think I understand, bro, a little better. Too tired to go talk to him. <laughs> you look like you're gonna doze off any second now. Go home for now, kid. 
Besides, I know you're gonna come again anyway. Even if I tell you not to. Kari! Have you talked to Mochi Yuzuki kun at all? No. Hmm. Okay, I was just wondering what sort of person he is. He seems really um affectionate. Is that normal overseas? Hey there. Hey yo, go somewhere! Hello, Takiba. Oh, and good morning to you too. Uh. Oh hey, good morning. <laughs> Please, come Ryoji. She's not transferring here. It's such an awkward time. I was hoping that I could get to know everyone better. Yeah. Oh, I see. It must suck having to transfer school so often. Yeah. Can't deny that. I should be used to it by now, but it's always hard to leave my new friends. Gets a little lonely, you know? How about keeping me company for a little while? Wanna grab a bite, a quick bite sometime? <laughs> That's my goat. That's my goat. That's my goat. I think we should all beat Ryoji to death with sticks. If you're leaving now, would you like to go shopping with me? Let's go. Thank you. Let's head to Polonia Mall. Sorry for taking so long. I wanted to buy something to use as a secret ingredient in my cooking. But I couldn't really decide, and I wasn't sure how to use whatever I'd buy. Mm, start with the basics. Yes, you're right. I haven't even gotten the basics down yet. I'm getting way too ahead of myself. First thing I need to do is find something that I can actually make. Good job. I'm still having a lot of trouble getting things right, but I can't give up yet. Not after all your support. And it's not like I have any other redeeming qualities. You have some? What? You're a hard worker! No, that's not true at all. I mean, everyone in our group works hard. And beyond that, I think you all have something that you're good at. Not me. I mean, I guess I'm sort of good with machines, but that's it. It's honestly not worth mentioning. Really. I just happen to like them. It's not exactly something worth boasting about. When I was little, I remember my dad's hobby was to work on complicated sound equipment. He'd fix things like broken amplifiers or headphones that only played sound on one side. I've always loved watching him work on those things. That's probably why I was drawn to working with machines in the first place. But I don't think that would be very useful to repay everyone's kindness. Plus, if we do ever have any technical needs, like when we're fighting, then we've always got the Kirijo group support. Not to mention that I'm kind of embarrassed about it all. I mean, it's not a very feminine hobby. Oh, well, why do you think that? Why? Huh, I don't know. Maybe because it was originally my dad's hobby? I sure seem to talk about my problems a lot, huh? Yeah. I wonder why it's so easy talking to you. Man, I need to change my personality or something, bro. I, I guess it's just a little annoying listening to all this venting. I feel like you stop me from being so negative all the time. Actually, I might owe a lot to you in that sense. She trusts me. That's cool. So much. Let's go home. Fook and I went back to the dorm together. Oh, welcome back. Just me and his Junpei seem unhappy about something. He's been mumbling under his breath. Is it a, it's about Chidori? What is his issue? What's up? Good morning. Morning. Get a load of this. 
Yeah, you know, the two of you would totally get along. He actually wanted to know more about Gungan Khan, so naturally I had to share my wisdom with him. Anyway, he's a real cool dude to hang with. Much obliged. Thanks for helping out, Junpei. Thanks especially for telling me he was the top 10 cuties in Gekko Khan High, too. Oh, pop down. If Yuki hears about this, my rep's gonna go down the toilet. Isn't it already rock bottom? No, no. Dude, quick rubber salt in my wound. I'm just just a mis easily misunderstood fellow, okay? <laughs> you two are pretty close, huh? Hope we can also be good friends. Shut up. I don't like him. I don't trust him. I just know he's evil. Let's get on with today's life. Whatever, bro. There you are. Finally found you. Hey, Takeba. You hardly ever miss student council meetings. I've been looking all over for you. Did someone ask you to come find me? Well, yeah. I'm not a member or anything, but still. Ah, oh, well. Sorry about that. You've been pretty busy, huh? What with the class trip and all. It's for both second and third years, so I imagine you have your hands full, too. The class trip. Even if I did go, I'd only spoil the fun. Wait, you're not thinking of skipping the trip, are you? <sighs> you can't do that. That's not an option. Hmm? You know, I've been meaning to talk to you. About what? Well, honestly, you're not the easiest person to relate to. Dang. But I lost my dad, too. And I know what that's like. Talk about. So I've decided I don't want our friendship to be over. I'm going to be more upfront with you from now on. <sighs> there she is. Oh, my goodness. I've been looking everywhere for you. Huh? Ryoji-kun? Why are you up here? Huh? Weren't you looking for Miss President, too? I was doing the same thing. Some guy asked me to find her. You just killed the whole mo- He said if I didn't, the class trip might get canceled. Ugh, Odagiri-kun. He'll hit up anyone in arm's reach for a favor. In any case, looks like I found you, Mitsuru Kirijo-san. And I have to say, you're quite stunning. Maybe we could go out sometime? I know this place on the top floor of a five-star hotel. The restaurant up there has a view of the city nightscape that's almost as breathtaking as you. Nightscape? Senpai, you better head back to the meeting. Oh, right. Don't get caught up in his antics! Talk about... Thank you for coming to find me. For now, I'd better see to my duties. Hey, she left without giving me an answer. For now, huh? I don't like the sound of that. Well, how about you, Yukari-san? Care to join me for dinner? Shut up! Some Shirakawa Boulevard. Good, thank you, Yukari! Ow. Thank you! Like, he's seriously pissing me off. Air hey, around me has shifted. I'm familiar scrap. Oh, snap. I got it. Oh, it's you. I will be joining you at Tartarus tonight. I apologize for worrying everyone. Our only priority now is to do something about Tartarus. Well, the school trip is next week, so that should be fine. But unfortunately, Yamada and Koromaru will have to stay here. You're such a smart boy, aren't you, Koromaru? You can even wield a weapon on your own. Who are you talking to? Koromaru's not even here. Could it be? Greedy Shadow. Okay. I'm also trying to get all of, like, trying to do all of Elizabeth's what you call it. And the Greedy Shadow was one of them. So I gotta make sure I get this. I'm gonna I'm I'm do my original plan, left, right, left, right, 
No, right, left, right. I expect. We're cheating! We're cheating! Nowhere to run now, bucko! Face reality, never be charity. Enemy of fight. Mom's not here, gotta fight. Right here, shadow 10 o'clock direction. Seize the moment to destroy your nation. Rhyme slow motion, give me motivation. Freak out now and get on the rival. Pop it up, all over. Oh, come in the ground. No, 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 no. Don't ease your pace cause enemies brutal Moment of truth, it ain't no truth We're the only one, one world, one love And the battle goes on, shadows up back Destruction Finish him up Door is tightly sealed. Nothing's happening? I wonder if the tarot cards you have right now aren't enough. Maybe there's a card that we missed somewhere. Do you mind checking the doors on the other floor again? I ain't doing all that. I've decided to leave the institution. I refuse to be involved in any crimes. The head researcher decided not to come with me. Maybe I'll open a store with my collection of antiques. Oh, well, I know who that is. That's the end. Okay. So that explains why she knows so much about personas. I was wondering that. That explains why. She was a part of the research team and she left. You have finally obtained the old document 08. This concludes my request for you to gather all the old documents. I wanted you to learn the truth from the eight documents you've collected. However, you are already moving toward another truth. Although memories may, may remind you of the past, always walk towards the future. <laughs> I must admit, I'm a bit envious since I have neither. Let's hear the results. Oh, what's this? I sense a strange power emanating from that bill. I thought it would have taken months and years to complete the hundred shrine visits. <laughs> but perhaps it is not the number of visits that matter, but the strength of your wish. Would be a wise choice what do you wish to inherit what can i give her it appears it will receive an immense amount of power well then shall we begin hey elise my name is alice you'll play with me won't you forever and ever i don't know i might Oh lord. Oh my goodness. Gotta do this. I'm in the Shinagawa dungeon. I see Maya. <laughs> I was waiting for you. So, um, I'm drunk. Oh really? Yeah, really? Save me, Tatsu. I'm sick of my job. No time to party. Three beers and counting. Eleven will... Eleven, will you hold my hair back? Rawr, I even have to work farm ho this weekend. Work from home. Uh, but now I'm all drunk. She sat down. I didn't used to be like this. I never had to work weekends, but lately I can't get motivated to get any work done. You're probably burned out, yeah.
that's what the beer is for, duh. I used to be able to power through, but... It's been eight years, though. Maybe I'm just getting old. I need my game and drinky time, but I'm haunted by deadlines. Irregardless of those deadlines closing in, I still end up logging on here. Oh, reg irregardless isn't a word. You know that. It's cuz... Uh, this will be on it. I'm sorry, I know I'm like I'm overreacting, but it genuinely is pissing me off the way that she types. Ever said LOL, all right, oh my goodness. What is Raffle? I know that people, a lot of people used to say that actually. That That is a, what's something a lot of people used to actually say. I never knew what it was though, I never found out. I used to see it, but I never knew what it stood for. Yeah, that might look cool. I'm not shaving my hair. You got a good attitude, kid. You do get what I'm saying, don't you? I'm not talking about fashion here, you know. I'm saying you'd be better off without your hair. Oh, sure, you're young and good looking now, but just you wait. I mean, look at me. I'm old and ugly. My cheeks sag like a damn bulldog's. That's life, kid. People get old. Someday you'll be just like me. One day in the future, you'll see your mug in the mirror and think, Damn, I was handsome back in the day. Here's a little trick so you don't lose hope in the future. Just don't expect nothing. Simple, huh? That way you won't ever be disappointed. That's extremely sad. You're gonna lose your hair eventually, kid, so why bother with it now? Bald is beautiful. You just wake up in the morning and go. No fuss. You'll need a hat for the winter, but I say go for it. I'll spot you money for a shave and some clippers if you're short. I saw Mutatsu's harsh words and felt his kindness. I didn't see any harsh words. Like he was just being, he was just, I don't know, just cracking. What is all my talking putting you to sleep? You can't sleep here, kid. Go home and rest in your own bed. Oh, my bad. Hey there. Hey, listen. You kind of bathing suit, flashlight. Yeah. You don't travel light, do you? I don't travel light. When I go places, I'll, I'll, I'll be wanting to bring everything I have. I'll be wanting to bring my whole room. In this section. I think you should be out visiting foreign countries, but I shut those ideas down every single year. It's shameful the way we've lost our passion for our homeland. Why don't we spend some time today learning about our country's innate beauty? You know our nation of flowers and shit? I don't care. Excuse me. Most of the people I appear to meet I meet up here nervous about the upcoming trip. Are you nervous? How about you, I guess? I don't know. Do I seem like I am? All right, Otagiri. I'm counting on you. For both our sakes. I understand. Oh. Hey, Otagiri, what was that about? What did he mean by for both our sakes? He just wants to create a better school environment, so he simply asked a student fit for the job. Calm down. Just like how the president asked him to join the student council to help out. What? You 
You can't decide something like that without talking to the president first. What happened? Someone found a cigarette butt in the boys' bathroom. And that teacher wants the disciplinary committee to look into whose it was. Okay. Someone has broken school rules. It's only natural that I'm involved in finding and holding the transgressor. Bro, bro, look. You're not about to find who was smoking cigarettes by finding a single cigarette butt in the bathroom. All right? What you gonna do? Look into the fingerprints? You gonna take a saliva sample and find his DNA, track him down, or kill his family? Like, what are you gonna do? The best you can do is try and catch him in the act at another day. That's the best you can do. Look, you have two choices. Either help out and prove you can be trusted, or refuse and prove you can't. <sighs> People like you and me have to deal with a lot of crap around here, don't we? I don't like this guy. Like, he's just annoying. He's like Kiyotaka if he was actually insufferable. Kiyotaka was cool. This guy's aggravating. Well then, I'll be excusing myself. Please excuse yourself. Away from me. Hey! Don't ignore me! You kiss ass! Student council members shouldn't be fighting like this, should they? I better go tell the president. Y'all making more work for the president as if she not sin as if she not depressed right now. Welcome back. No, it's cool trip. I'm so psyched. Kind of sucks for oh. going to Kyoto though. <laughs> what are you talking about? I'm always energetic. Yes. Don't throw any parties while I'm gone. Don't worry about bringing me back a souvenir. Trying to use reverse psychosis no. on me. Okay, shut up. Y'all talking too much. Ain't nothing to talk about. Ain't nothing to talk that much about, bro. And I mean that as disrespectfully as possible. Hey, hey, hey. With the burning desire every day. We gonna chill today and then we rock the world tomorrow, you know? All right, that's the end of the episode. Oh, wait, hold on. That's the end of the episode, guys. If y'all enjoyed, like, subscribe, leave a comment. I'll read them all. Tap into that episode. Uh, today was cool. You know, we, we did some leveling up. Uh, I guess I was extremely over leveled for this dungeon. Um, I didn't, I didn't really mean to level myself up like that. Uh, we got some requests done, and we did some social links. I am going to try and um, get all the achievements in my first playthrough. I doubt I will. I doubt that I will. But I'm still going to try. All right, I'm gonna do my best. So peace out. I love you guys. Tap in.